James Doran from the Schneider Electric Level 2 Technical Support Team. In this video I'll be explaining how you can install the drivers and software for the Connex configuration tool. You'll need to download the drivers and the configuration tool software first. And ensure that you are choosing the correct version. Go to the sesolar.com website and there under the products you'll be able to go down to the off-grid and backup, down to the accessories and then choose the Connex configuration tool specific web page. On the configuration tool web page scroll down to the download section and open up the firmware subsection and download both the drivers as well as the specific version of the configuration tool software that you'd like, whether that be the general or the approved installer. Once they've been installed onto the desktop, firstly install the drivers by starting and clicking next. Acknowledge the um, license agreement, ensure that you put in the path that you want, install it and that will install the config tool device drivers. You will still need to configure that before connecting the actual Kinex configuration tool. Under device programs, go to the actual ISTAN uh, driver config and then here you'll need to add a USB device and then select the device and change the serial number to match the Connex configuration tool um, that you have. So this is found on the bottom of the actual Connex configuration tool. Once you have installed the drivers, you can connect the Connex configuration tool. And like I said, the underside of the tool has the serial number noted. So once the device drivers have been installed and configured, you can then install the Connex configuration tool software by clicking on the installer and then clicking next and then selecting the path and clicking next and ensuring if you want a desktop icon to be installed and click the installation. We can then launch the actual Connex configuration tool software to configure the Zanbus network to check its status to save things. If the Connex configuration tool is the last device, you can right move the terminator switch to ensure that the terminator is on for end-of-line devices.